everyone. Happy Monday. I hope you all had a really incredible long weekend if you had one. We certainly did. Today was a public holiday, which was awesome. Um, but I wanted to jump in and talk to you about a couple of things. Um, I've got Facebook going over here, Instagram going over here. So let's see how we go. Um, but I wanted to chat to you about a few things. So the first thing is I want to quickly run through this month's promotions, which have just been announced. And then I'm going to take you through the new products. So uh, my incredible upline, yes, the Brisbane weather was amazing. Um, went to the global convention in Utah, which I will be going to next year. So I'm super excited for that. And when you go to a convention, you have the opportunity to purchase a convention kit, which is great because it means that all the new products that are released, which everyone is super excited about, you get to take home with you, which is awesome because often those products are not an, not released straight away uh, to the market. Some of them are being released in the US probably tomorrow. Uh, they're behind us, so it sometimes means that there's a bit of a lag, um, but they will be released, majority of them, which I'll go through this month. There's a couple being released in November. Just realized I left the On Guard mouthwash downstairs. Um, and then also there'll be one available in December. So getting a convention kit is amazing because you get all the products there and then. So I'll take you through each of those. There's a few that I'm super excited about. I've got all my notes here because um, I listened to a fantastic podcast. If you're into all the sciencey stuff, I highly recommend going and listening to Ange Peters from Whole Fit, H-O-L, hey Tracy, um, dash fit, F-I-T. And she's got an awesome podcast. She's got show notes that take you through all of the different scientific studies in relation to all the oils. Um, it's amazing. So go and have a listen to that. I've listened to that. I've done a little bit of research and I've popped my notes down, um, which I'll, I'll go through a little bit of it, but I'm not going to get too sciencey on you. I promise. Um, but firstly, promotions have just been announced. If you are on my team, check your emails. I have already sent through, um, all of the promotions for this month. So if you're on my team, make sure you check your emails and also check for last month's giveaway, um, which is exciting. Um, but in the US, you can actually purchase all the new products, which will be 230 US dollars. So you would need to convert that to Australian dollars. Um, that will constitute a 200 PV order. And that means that you will get a free car diffuser. And then you get three citrus oils. One of them is clementine. So you can imagine how excited I am to get um, clementine oil because it is in a few of our blends, but you can't actually purchase it singly. So I'm excited about that. 320 Australian dollars. Thank you very much, Tash. So you get red mandarin, clementine and kumquat, which is a really, really interesting oil to say out loud. Um, but you get those three for free and also a car diffuser. Car diffuser is life changing. It's amazing. Um, if you already have a car diffuser, then you'll have one ready to gift for Christmas, which is amazing. Um, so 200 PV orders um, in the US warehouse are going to get you those three for free and the car diffuser. Um, and you'll get all of the convention products. It's much cheaper to purchase it as that pack. Um, so I highly recommend doing it that way. But if you're wanting to grab individual oils as well, as long as it gets to 200 PV, um, you're going to get those three citrus oils and the diffuser. The other thing you'll receive, uh, one of the values of the loyalty rewards program, which I'm sure you all shop at Woolies. All the LRP program is, is essentially like a frequent flyer program. Um, when you accumulate 2000 points with Woolworths, they give you $10 off your shopping on your little orange card. When you accumulate 2000 points with doTERRA, you'll get approximately $568 epic so so epic so when i found that out i walked around my house and i wrote a list of all the things that i could replace toothpaste body wash detergent um hand wash everything because i was like well if i'm gonna get more money for purchasing from here then i'm going to do so i mean at the start it wasn't even the fact that they were non-toxic that was important to me which sounds horrendous but at the time i was just like i'm all about saving money so being on the loyalty rewards program is, in, is insane. It's, it's incredible. I just stockpile all my points and then buy all the shit that I don't want to spend my money on, like toothpaste. It's simple, right? It makes sense. 
So if you're purchasing from the US warehouse on a loyalty rewards program order and you make it 200 PV, you're going to get those three citrus oils, car diffuser, and also a lemon, lemon essential oil, which is great because you can never have too much lemons, really high in limonene, um, great for you know cholesterol, blood sugar levels, um, skin health, immune support, all the things. Great to add into your water, great for cleaning as well, it's five cents a drop. So if you're going to be cleaning with essential oils, clean with lemon, so you'll get that for free. Um, and the 10% off product is Terrazyme. Now that's a supplement that you get from the US warehouse. I have one every morning. Um, and it essentially just helps your body absorb all of the nutrients from the good food that you're eating. So Terrazyme, super important. I have one every morning. Um, placing a US order is exactly the same as placing an Australian order. All you have to do is just click on US products that's it and just make sure you convert it make sure you check what it's going to cost you um, okay and a couple of ideas as well for people that are not quite sure about what to get from the US warehouse I do a US order probably every two to three months um, and I get my lifelong vitality supplements Terrazyme which is great because that's 10% off Mito 2 Max I take one of those in the morning as well it's fantastic for energy the On Guard soft gels, so they are just like little soft, like vegetable soft gels um, that are great for immune support. It's kind of like a cold and flu tablet, essentially. Um, they also have Melissa in it. A five mil bottle of Melissa is about three hundred and thirty dollars, um, or maybe it's two hundred and thirty dollars. I don't know. It's just really, really expensive, um, and it's incredible for immune support. So the On Guard soft gels, I get. I get the Digest Zen soft gels. I get the Tri Ease soft gels. Um, they're basically like your hay fever tablets. Um, spray and roller bottles you can now get from the US warehouse and also a pump for your fractionated coconut oil. So they're just a few ideas um, for a US LRP cart. For everyone on my team, I've linked to all of those in the email that I sent out. So if any of those interest you, make sure you click on the link and go and have a read um, because it is handy to get sort of everything that you need from the US warehouse because not all of us really do a US order every month. If you'd prefer to do an Australian order, um, the 200 PV Ice Blue promotion has continued. Uh, so if you place a 200 PV order before the 15th, you're going to get Ice Blue Rub, 5 mil Ice Blue for free. Great for growing pains for kids, sore muscles, sore back, whatever it might be. Uh, free product of the month if you're placing your loyalty rewards program um, before the 15th, 125 PV orders will get you tangerine. Tangerine is fantastic to add to water. Again, really high in limonene, um, you know, which is yeah, great for cholesterol, blood sugar, immune support, all the things. Um, again, if you're on my team, I've linked to a study about limonene in your email as well. 10% uh, off is Terra Armor. That's our bug repellent, essentially. So you can either make that into a spray, you can diffuse it, you can apply it to your skin with fractionated coconut oil. It smells fine, so it's easy to put on your skin. It doesn't, you know, smell like traditional bug repellent. Um, and for newbies, for anyone that hasn't got started, um, there's an incredible pro promo for you because if you place your order um, for 125 PV or more, so the Home Centrals kit, for example, um, before the 15th, you're going to get Ice Blue Rub, Ice Blue Oil, and 50 points credited to your account next month. So that was announced today as well, which is super exciting and very unexpected. So that's a really, really quick run through of all of the promotions. I'll probably do some social media images, but um, for our team, you've got it in an email. So any questions, respond to the email, send me a text, and I will walk you through it because it is a bit confusing the first time you do a US order. Even though it's one click, it's still a bit weird, especially when you've already got an Australian order set up. Um, so let's get right into it. New products. So like I said, you get to purchase one of these amazing convention kits. Um, same with the Australian convention, if you're heading to that in Sydney in May. Um, there'll be new products that are released there. Probably a couple of these, I would say, because at the moment these are only available in the US warehouse. Um, but it's great to go to convention because you learn about all the new products and you get to take them home when you purchase a convention kit. So the first thing we're going to start off with is probably the thing that I'm most excited about and I think our team is most excited about is the kids collection. So they've finally done some, some pre-diluted essential oil rollers. Um, on stage, Emily Wright, who is one of the doTERRA founders, said that um, they're best suited for kids that are over three. Um, I personally will be using them on Clementine. She is two. Um, they are, they don't smell strong. Um, I have tested them on myself today uh, and I'm 
so comfortable using them for her but just as an fyi that's what they said the recommended age was at convention on stage so there's six and what it comes with so this is what they look like so unbelievably cute you also get the flashcards let me just open this because i put them back in the packet because i didn't want to ruin how nice the convention kit looked so you get these cute little cards as well, which tells you exactly how to use them and what each one is for, which I think is really cute. Comes in this little pack as well. And then there's also some clips for them to clip them to their bag. So if you've got older kids, then you can put all of the blends, um, they've got this little lid on them with a clip and you can clip it to their bag, which I think is super cute. I think it's really empowering to be giving, um, you know, kids these tools you know, to be in control of their emotions, just the same as we are. So super excited about this and um, yeah, and they're really cute too. They look amazing. So, all right, so these are little flashcards. Um, it's got note for care caregivers, which is so cute. Use these blends as powerful daily affirmations for your child as you care for their growing body. Oh my God, melt. Um, these flashcards are a quick guide on how to use and explore your kids collection, blah, blah, blah. Um, okay, so the first one we'll start with, I'll get them all out. I'll quickly whiz through all of them so you can see. So you've got Thinker on here, Focus Blend. So it's kind of like my Inspire Blend and what I tell, you know, like the, for, for those that are watching it on my team, like the Inspire Blend in your recipe ebook. Um, when it's time to get creative and focus, roll Thinker onto the back of your neck to support your mind and enhance learning. So Thinker has got, I'm pretty sure this might have Clementine in it actually. I know it's got Rosemary. I oh, know vetiver, peppermint, clementine, and rosemary. So really, really uplifting. Rosemary is the best oil you can have for focus, apart from lemon and peppermint, in my opinion. Smells really good. I yeah, I personally don't think it smells very strong. It smells not as strong as the touch, um, the emotional aromatherapy touch kit. So you know, console, forgive, passion. These are nowhere near as strong. So perfect for kids. Um, like I said, I'll be using them on Clementine, but the recommended age is three. So Thinker, great for focus, homework, take to school for, you know, during class, before class, amazing. Next one, Karma, Restful Blend, lathered the shit out of Clementine today. When it's bedtime, roll Karma onto the bottoms of your feet and onto your wrists, climb into bed and take a deep breath to let your mind rest. So that's Karma, which... I've got here, so we've got lavender, canagar, buddha wood, roman chamomile. Roman chamomile is one of the only essential oils that will soothe all the body systems. So incredibly supportive of sleep and just calming support. That is, oh, throwing it around, karma. And then we've got stronger protective blend, which is very like an, an alternative to an on guard touch roller, for example, or the daily immune support, which I use, which is on guard frankincense and a little bit of arborvitae as well. Use stronger on the back of your neck or bottoms of your feet for an added boost or for protection when you're not feeling your best. Um, so, you know, not only is on guard fantastic for immune support um, and protecting against any nasties, but emotionally great for, you know, barriers, protecting your tire, protecting your space. So a really empowering oil for kids. So this is stronger. I love that it's red too, because, you know, we all know that red is the fastest color. Uh, this has got cedarwood, litsia, frankincense, and rose. Rose is oh, so incredible for immune support. So so high vibe, highest, highest vibrational oil on the planet. So that is stronger. And then we've got rescuer, soothing blend. After running, jumping, and playing, rub rescuer onto your legs, feet, or back to soothe your active body. So this is rescuer. This is the blue one. And we've got kabiba, copaiba. Lavender, spearmint, and xanthoxylum fruit. I don't know how to say it, but oh, I think this is probably my favorite smelling one, the Rescuer Soothing Blend. And two more quickly. We have Steady Grounding Blend. For those times when you feel nervous or anxious, rub steady on your neck and wrist to calm and comfort your emotions. So this would be really good uh, for kids that sort of suffer from separation anxiety, get a little bit nervous about going to school, playing sport, things like that. So this has Amiris, balsam fir, coriander, and magnolia. Oh my God, I can't wait to tell you about magnolia. It smells like lollies. I smell the magnolia in this, it's incredible. 
Okay, brave, courage blend. This is our last one. Before new or different situations or to just start your day. Roll brave onto your tummy or bottoms of feet for a boost of courage or confidence. Isn't this amazing? I just can't wait for Clementine to get to the age where we can have those discussions and really start involving her in the process, which I already do, but I just think it's so empowering. Wild orange, Amiris, Osmanthus, and cinnamon. Smells like wild orange to me, I think. Brave. Which I think is great because, you know, brave is also, in my opinion, associated to confidence. So love the kids' kit. Love that it comes in this little bag. Love that they can flip it to their backpack. Pre-diluted, ready to go. Amazing. Like, incredible. Okay, so the next thing. This is freaking life-changing. This is so amazing. It's not available until November 1. So if you want it now please make sure that you place your order in the US warehouse for all of the products because it is amazing. So this is the body mist. Um, it's got the beautiful blend in it, which you can usually per purchase around Christmas time. Um, a lightweight body mist, perfect for hydrating your skin daily. So the coolest part about this is not only that it is incredible for your skin, like honestly it feels, and I'm not bullshitting you because I am so like, Body mist and things like that, I think, are a crock of shit, basically. Um, body mist just sounds weird to me. I'm like, is that a moisturizer? Is it a mist? Are you meant to, like, rub it in? What do you do? I don't understand the process. So I was really skeptical about this. What I love is that it feels amazing. So it smells incredible. But you can spray. It's got, like, a 360-degree applicator. I don't know if you can really see it. But it means this is amazing because I currently don't have a husband that lives here. So... You know, I need all the freaking help I can get for applying things to my back. <laughs> you can spray it. Like, you can stand here like this and spray your back. Like, is that not life-changing? Is there any other mists that do that? Like, when I read about it, I was like, oh, why don't all sprays do that? Like, that would be the logical thing to do, right? Um, but it's amazing. It smells incredible. So this is how it's sprayed. I'll just spray it. Like that. It smells... <sighs> Honestly, like this is probably, this and Magnolia are my two favorites. It's really beautiful when you rub it in and it absorbs really quickly. So see, it's like already absorbed, which is great for, you know, being, like, cause I was always really skeptical to even use fractionated coconut oil on my skin in the mornings before getting dressed. Cause I'm like, oh, well, I'm going to put my clothes on and all my work clothes are going to get ruined. No, it absorbs straight away. Let me read out some of the ingredients. Very nourishing. So we've got um, coconut oil. We've got lime, that's why it smells incredible. Sunflower seed oil, passion fruit seed oil, osmanthus, bergamot. Bergamot is oh, so good. The oil of self-acceptance, great for emotional support. Frankincense. Frankincense is distilled from Boswellia trees in Somalia in extremely harsh conditions. It's basically a desert. Um, desert, harsh conditions, anti-aging for your skin. Feel me? Like... They're the properties that we're talking about. And this has got frankincense in it. So how amazing is that? Frankincense, by the way, is $90 for a bottle. So you need this shit in your life. <laughs> um, and avocado oil, which is incredibly nourishing as well. So this is a must-have item. Also, if you would like prices, um, you can actually go on to... Let me just go into it on my computer now. Sorry. Is it okay to go into the sun? Yes. So I personally would be okay. Um, like I would go and do it because it's not like you're applying the actual lime essential oil to your skin, but be very careful. So don't go and sunbake. I would not be doing that. Um, but I applied it this morning. This morning. I'm losing the plot. I applied it this morning and I was around the sun. I wasn't like sunbaking or anything, but I was outside today um, and it was fine. My skin wasn't blotchy. I've tested it. But in saying that, please don't go on sunbake. Like, it's not a sun tanning oil. Um, but I think I, I think you would be okay. Um, but the price is, if you just go on to doTERRA.com, so the US warehouse, uh, sorry, the US site, a big, like, flash, a big banner comes up where you can click on the products. I know there was a few questions about that. Um, so this individually is 25 US wholesale so it'll be a bit more expensive um once converted but it's only available from the u.s warehouse so you'd be paying that and then it would be converted so yeah um i mean i think it's amazing it does it says on the bottle that you like you should avoid uv exposure 
you know, after you use it. Um, so, you know, use at your discretion. But if you're just sort of in and out of the car and things like that, then I think that you're totally fine. Like I said, I sprayed it on my body um, and I was fine. But yeah, just don't go on sunbake. I would not recommend doing that. Okay, let me just go back to Facebook. Oh, Facebook looks like it's gone a bit crazy. <laughs> Sorry, guys, my Wi Fi sucks. Um, okay, next product. Sorry, I'm just going to move this out of the way. Um, so, like I said, that's not available until November 1st. Yep, yeah, November 1st. So, if you'd like it straight away, make sure you get the pack. Um, so it has that beautiful blend in it, which is an actual essential oil roller, which smells amazing. It's got a really dewy, like healthy glow. Like you could, it's probably a bit hard to see, but it's absorbed straight away. It's quite glowy, lots of hydrating oils. Yeah. Amazing. Be great to dry brush in the morning and then use it. Incredible. Okay. Let's go with the deodorant. So I don't use... I will be, I love this, but I don't use the current doTERRA deodorant. Tom does. He likes it. I'm a bit stinky. I prefer something more. So I've been using the Erica Brooke natural deodorant. This, they've nailed it. They have fucking nailed it. It is so good. It's got balance in it, which if you love balance, you're going to love this. It's like kind of got a bit of a greeny tinge to it, which is like the balance. Smells incredible. Um, has baking soda in it. Uh, I think they're bringing out a baking soda uh, free one. See if you're allergic to that. They're also bringing out a citrus bliss one. Um, but it's not gritty. So often I find with natural deodorants, um, you know, the, the main ingredient is baking soda. And I find that it goes quite gritty. Now, I've only used this today. So I can't comment on whether it's going to get gritty over time. Um, the podcast that I listened to, Ange had been using it for, I think about six weeks and she said it hadn't. Uh, if yours does go, go like that, a little tip is to just put a drop of essential oil onto the top before you apply. A good one is geranium. Really beautiful to add. And you can even add balance. I mean, this is the balance deodorant. So you can add a drop of balance, um, and that will sort of get yeah, help with the grittiness. Um, there are about 20... Sorry, let me just get my Facebook back up and going. One moment, please, Instagram. Okay. This is what happens when you live in a really shit Wi-Fi area. Okay, let's go back. Um, so we have about 20 lymph nodes in our armpits. So what you're putting on your pits is very, very important. Um, a lot of the time aerosols and those types of deodorants carry a lot of harmful su substances um, and we do not want to be putting that on our armpits because our lymph nodes is what like is great for lymphatic drainage and getting rid of the toxins in your body um, that's why I love to use you may have heard me say before to use magnesium salts with some lemon essential oil and massage that into your armpits um, and also around your groin area because there's also lymph nodes there um, and you can even massage into your neck because there's lymph nodes there as well. So you don't want to be, you know, applying toxic substances to an area that is trying to remove the toxins from your body because you're just going to block that up, which is not nice. So really be cautious about the deodorant that you're using. Um, I, I mean, I used this today. I've only used it one day, but I love it um, so far. I think it's very different to the, um, the plain one that they have. I think this is much better. Um, but time will tell. So I'll keep you posted on that. But Tom uses the, the doTERRA deodorant anyway. Um, okay, mouthwash. I l did leave that downstairs. But um, it's an OnGuard mouthwash. Um, the toothpaste, the OnGuard toothpaste, which I love and I use. It's fluoride free. I love using it, um, especially, you know, for Clementine. Because what two-year-old is going to understand? I love my natural deodorant. Yes. Love that, Tracy. Um, I love the Erica Brooke one. So if anyone's will wanting to try a different one as well, the Erica Brooke, his and hers is amazing. Um, but the On Guard toothpaste, so uh, love that it's fluoride free. Um, no two-year-old understands that they're not meant to swallow their toothpaste. So uh, I like that I don't have to stress so much about that because it doesn't have fluoride in it. Um, and that toothpaste launched in 2011 and it's, it's one of the most popular products. So highly recommend giving that a go. Um, the mouthwash has the OnGuard micro encapsulated, 
um, so the oils don't separate. So often with traditional, um, like with natural mouthwashes um, that don't have the chemicals and the preservatives in it, often you have to shake it a lot and they don't taste very good because the oil is not micro encapsulated. So it is, uh, you don't have to shake it. Um, it has xylitol and it's something like Merwak extract or something like that. I don't have the bottle with me, it's downstairs, but if anyone wants a photo of it, I'm happy to take a photo and send you send it to you in DM. Um, but basically that helps to reduce plaque and restore your mouth pH. So they did a human trial with the On Guard mouthwash and 70% of the, of the participants had a healthy pH range after four days which is amazing. Um, I usually just gargle. Um, I've made my own mouthwash before with peppermint on guard. Um, I usually just gargle peppermint uh, and swish that around my mouth. So I'm loving the fact that I don't have to worry about any of that anymore. It's just pour it into the cap, have a little bit of that, spit it out. Happy days. Um, if you would like to use it with your kids, that's fine. Um, but I would recommend adding it to a cup with some water so they're not just having it by itself. Okay. Next is the Kabiba Soft Gels, which I have not even opened yet. So you may have heard me, I mean, the, the, tech, the correct pronunciation is Kopaiba. Um, you may have heard me chat about that. I think I have it here. Yep. I have it in my room because it's fantastic for sleep. Kabiba, Kopaiba, whatever you want to say. They have now bought it out in soft gels and apparently all 20,000 people in the stadium at convention went nuts absolutely nuts for these soft gels so this is what it looks like they're not very big i've always been traditionally quite bad at swallowing tablets so i find that it's totally fine it's how big it is um so the main constituent in kobaiba is bcp and that funnily enough um closely resembles cannabis like the effect that cannabis would have on your body um, and the effect that it has on your end, endocannabinoid system. Um, so basically, so there's 60 in here, 60 soft gels. Um, and doTERRA's Copaiba oil is the only Copaiba oil available on the market that blends four types of copal resin to create an oil with 60% of this BCP, right? Um, and like I said, that gives the same therapeutic effect of cannabis oil without the negative or psychotropic side effects okay um, so instead of interacting with our CB1 receptors it interacts with our CB2 receptors in our endocannabinoid system um, so it's incredibly good for your nervous system um, it's it's quite similar to frankincense and that it kind of affects all your body systems um, fantastic for sleep um, comes from a tree in the Amazon um, so there's no risk of contamination with THC, which is the cannabis side of it. Um, what else can I tell you? Supports the health of cardiovascular, immune, digestive, respiratory systems. Really, really high antioxidant properties. Incredible. Um, a lot of people have a drop of frankincense and a drop of copaiba under their tongue every morning. Um, I usually do it just if I feel under the weather, I'm coming down with something or I'm particularly stressed. Um, Tom, however, likes to do it every day. Uh, because both are really great for inflammation and obviously running around all the time, you know, um, he needs it. Um, so it helps to calm, soothe and support the nervous system. Great for your skin as well. So taking it internally or applying oil to your skin. Um, yeah, so I personally don't take Copaiba every day, but before usually like if I'm really stressed, like I was saying, or public speaking sometimes, um, you know, if I'm speaking to a large, like a really large group and I'm a little bit nervous about it, it's great to take. Um, and if you need a good night's sleep, take one to two of these soft gels. Yeah, so Hannah, I would take one to two of these if you're really struggling with sleep. Um, very similar to the Serenity soft gels. I love to take these as well. If I'm going to bed late, I usually don't take them because it's it doesn't knock you out. It's not that traditional. Like I've had sleeping tablets before um, and it's not the same as that. Um, but I'm interested to see how Co Kobaiba goes because I think this is better. Um, from what I've read and from what people have said, it's yeah, really, really amazing. So um, great that it's in a, in, you know, so easy to take because a lot of people don't like putting the oils like under their tongue. It doesn't taste that great. Um, so yeah, super excited to, um, yeah, try those. And like I said, I'm probably not going to do it every day, but yeah, I know Laura. Um, 
The Essential Life book, which is also in an app for iPhone. So definitely get that. Um, I'll just check that I haven't forgotten anything for Copaiba. Um, yeah, so the chemical composition, you know, the, the BCP means that it supports literally every body system because the BCP and your endocannabinoid system, um, you know, in the body and that interac interaction with each other is a really, really powerful antioxidant. So it's going to be amazing to use. Okay, next, Magnolia Touch. Oh, this is amazing. Yes, when, um, Rebecca, when you... Sorry, someone's trying to call me. Um... Hang on one second. Um, this is, you can't buy them separate. Not yet. So you probably won't be able to buy them. Oh, you'll be able to buy them separate, some of them, from the US warehouse, not in Australia. They will not be released until, could you take both of them? I'll answer that in a second, Tracy. Um, until after our convention. Um, I'm not sure if all of them will get released in the Australian warehouse after our convention. Usually some of them are approved in time um, with the TGA, but not always. So at this stage, they're all from the US warehouse. Some of them you can purchase individually. Some are not yet available. Um, like the Body Mist is November um, and the Yarrow Palm, which I'll talk about in a second, um, is going to be December. So you can only get all of them right now in a pack. Um, and also the kids kit, I think maybe November as well. Um, okay. Just making sure Facebook is okay. Could you take both of them as in Copaiba and the Serenity soft gels? Um, I would not take two of each, um, but one of each would be fine. Um, but I would probably give it a go, uh, taking them separately just to see what you prefer. That's what I would probably do. Um, okay, so the Magnolia Touch smells like lollies. Literally lollies. Who has smelt Magnolias before? Tell me what you think it smells like. I just cannot tell you any more apart from lollies. <laughs> it smells amazing. It's a really, really great addition to the floral oils. So... This goes with your rose, your jasmine, your neroli. It is stunning. It's stunning. Um, it is fairly pricey, I think, to get it individually. Let me just go back to the prices. Oh, no, it's not. $28 US. That's not too bad. That's not too bad at all. Um, yeah, I'm actually surprised. Actually, I think it's the Yarrow Palm that's quite expensive. So that's pretty cheap. What I'm going to be doing um, with my Magnolia is when I mist my face morning and night, I use one of the floral oils um, to pat in the mist. So I use either Rose, Jasmine, Neroli, and then also Salia Bell, um, which has some really incredible essential oils in there for my skin. So it's great to mix up your oils because your body needs different chemical constituents at different times. Okay, so it's great to... Um, yeah, mix it up a little bit. Now, just in relation to this, so in the, the chemical constituent in lavender that helps to soothe and calm is linalool, L-I-N-A-L-O-O-L. That's what it's called. And that's the chemical constituent that calms your farm. So in this bottle, there is 70% linalool. In lavender, it's about 20% just to put it into perspective. So if you feel all the calm vibes from lavender, just wait till you use this, okay? Now, it's not available in a bottle, it's only available in the touch, and that is because it takes 5,000 blossoms to make a tiny five mil bottle, okay? It, it takes a lot of flowers. So that's why it's only available in a touch. Similar to rose, you can't buy rose in a bottle because that would be like $1,000. <laughs> um, and you need a lot of roses to make that. So we don't want to be, you know, getting too much of it when it takes a lot to make it. So yeah, magnolia, really, really calming. Um, so it's, yeah, twice as much as lavender, more than that. So you can imagine how calming it's going to be. Um, and it's good, like I said, to use alternatively with lavender. So if you really love lavender for your skin, uh, which I do, I love to use the Lavender Touch as well. That's another one that I interchange. And um, then give this a go. 
instead. Um, so emotionally, it's very calming. Um, it's got monoterpenes in it, so it's great. Um, you can use it as a perfume, and I'm also going to be using it under my eyes. So I like to use all of the floral oils, like just a swipe like this under my eyes because it's great for dark circles so i like to do rose jasmine neroli lavender and i'm going to be using this one now so it really does smell incredible it smells like lollies okay now pink pepper this smells so good we already have pink pepper i can't remember how i got it maybe like mother's day or something some sort of special um it's really hard to describe this apart from to say it smells like pink pepper <laughs> it's like sweet pepper um, smells really, really incredible. I've been using a blend with this and Aroma Touch for my sore muscles. If you like to go and get massages, then a blend with pink pepper and Aroma Touch would be beautiful. Harmony kit. There we go. Thanks, Hannah. Um, so I, I didn't really use it that much. And then I listened to Angela's podcast and did a bit of research about pink pepper. Um, and apparently Emily Wright, when they announced it on stage that it was going to be a permanent product, called it the super oil because it really, really does everything. Um, so it's harvested from Kenya and Peru, um, and it's actually indigenous to Peru, but British colonists brought the trees with them to Kenya. So that's really great that we can serve both of those economies, okay? Because so, remember, doTERRA co-impact sources all of its essential oils, and it just gets the essential oils from wherever it, the plant thrives best in its organic state. It doesn't plant its own farms, which I love. I think it's really beautiful that we can purchase these oils to help us support our immune systems and give back, okay? I think that's really important. So pink pepper is really high in limonene. So we spoke, I think I spoke about limonene um, earlier on. Did I? Yeah, I did. Um, a lot of the citrus oils are really high in limonene and that's just fantastic for your overall health, um, cardiovascular, blood sugar, cholesterol, everything. Um, and it's also really high in alpha felandrine. Um, so in contrast, blue tansy has 5% alpha felandrine and pink pepper has 15 to 30 percent and that's the constituent the constituent that protects your cells okay that's why it's an incredible uh, just an amazing powerhouse oil um so it's similar to ddr prime if anyone has used the ddr prime oil or the soft gels i love the soft, soft gels and that just basically protects against free radicals huge antioxidant support um I usually take a DDR Prime soft gel when I'm under the weather. I know there's a lot of people that take them daily. Um, I personally don't, but um, I always have them there if I need them. Um, so you could use them as an alternative to DDR Prime or use the, you know, use pink pepper on your body, um, you know, in, in conjunction with that as well. So it will soothe and relax the nervous system. And the limonene, like I said, helps with blood sugar and cholesterol levels. So it's pretty much good for every inch of your body. Um, one thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to use pink pepper, just a couple of drops on my dry brush in the mornings when I dry brush my skin. Um, dry brushing, I think, is totally underestimated. It's one of the best things you can do for your body and lymphatic drainage. Um, the only thing to really know about dry brushing is to brush upwards. So start you know, at your fingertips and brush upwards, everything towards your heart because your heart is what is pumping all of the toxins out from your lymph nodes. Okay, so same with your feet, start with your toes and work your way up. Okay, um, so like I said, two drops on a dry skin brush. Um, I've been using that roller bottle. Great to diffuse as well with citrus oils like with green mandarin, which we'll chat about in a second. Beautiful. Um, okay, so green mandarin, which is sourced from Brazil. I also have a little bottle of these, which came in um, another little kit that you could purchase, but it has never been a permanent oil. I've been having this in my water the last couple of days. Ugh, smells so good. Um, so apparently at convention, um, the farmer that sources this, who has been sourcing and harvesting green mandarin um, since 1873, uh, was at convention because doTERRA flew out all of the farmers that we have co-impact sourcing relationships with to Utah. Isn't that amazing? Um, so yeah, just beautiful. So this oil um, has an interesting quality. Now, green mandarin, it's a citrus oil. But something that's very interesting about green mandarin is it is not photosensitive. So it's called green mandarin because they harvest it when the mandarins are green. Okay, so previously, they would just get rid of them. Um, so if they were green, they just considered them not harvestable. I don't even know if that's a word, um, but they would not harvest them because they were green and un in, in their opinion, not healthy. And, and that's why they didn't um, 
distill and harvest them and, and put them in an essential oil bottle. Um, but they figured out that there was a use for green mandarins. Um, not just the not photosensitive quality, um, but it's in, great for digestion, um, you know, great for cholesterol levels, high in limonene, healthy glucose metabolism. Um, yeah, beautiful. So great to add to your water, really nice to diffuse. Um, you know, maybe with some earthy and woody tones, I mean, you could do it with pink pepper, but you know, cedarwood, sandalwood, um, it'd be amazing. So that's that. Um, okay, yarrow palm. Ugh. This excites me. I can't wait to add this into my skin routine. So this is dark color. Oops. That's what it looks like. Very similar to blue tansy, but not as blue. So blue tansy is literally smurf. Your face is a smurf um, for a little bit. So when I do my mask, you can tell, but this is not as blue. And when you rub it in, how cool is that? Um, so in the convention kits, it's 15 mils, but when it's available for individual purchase in December, it will be 30 mils and it will have a dropper top on it because it's, it, it's best used internally. Okay, so this is an expensive oil. It will be $95 wholesale. Okay, very pricey. And it is essentially the inside out approach to aging. Okay, we always talk about food being, you know, really, really important for, um, you know, like your skin. It's all well and good to use great products on your skin, but if you're not, you know, fueling your gut um, and, you, and you don't have good gut bacteria, then it doesn't really matter, you know. So Yarrow Palm, similar thing. Incredible for aging um, if you're using it, you know, internally as well. So um, let's have a look has the ability to inhibit the, enzyme, the enzymes that break down your skin elasticity and collagen. We all know that collagen is really, really important uh, for your skin health. So if we can affect the enzymes and inhibit the enzymes from breaking down your skin elasticity and collagen, why would we not be using it, right? Life-changing. Okay, so I take collagen daily. I have the Nutri Organics collagen, uh, either in a smoothie or um, sometimes with my chia like pudding, because um, it doesn't, you know, taste like anything. It just tastes like nothing. Um, you can have it in tea. It doesn't taste like anything. Um, so I have collagen anyway, but I'm like, this is what I'm most excited about is to put this into my routine. Um, collagen is is your youthfulness. Okay, elasticity, again youthfulness so i think it's amazing that they've bought this out um and yes i think that's probably all i wanted to say about that um but the reason it's blue is because of the yes 95 us it's because of the schmazzoline that is in it so when you get your essential oil bottle there's a little number that you can search in the source to you website and it tells you all the chemical constituents in that bottle oh i just i can't get enough i'm trying to think of like how I can explain the smell. It's kind of, not many people would have blue tansy, but if you have blue tansy, it's it's quite similar. So I will be taking, I'm gonna use this in my skin routine. Um, probably not every day. Like I said, I really do like to mix it up because I think that has what has helped my skin so much is that I do mix it up so much and, and there's oils with different chemical constituents. I don't lather my face in oils. I Like I said, I just roll a little bit or put a bit on my hand and when I mist my face, um, I pat it in with the oil on there. Um, so I think that it will be, yeah, just incredible. So you can um, take it internally. So I haven't tried that yet. Um, haven't got to that point, but I am planning on giving it a whirl. Like I said, it's going to come with a dropper top because it is going to be intended to take internally and they recommend one to two drops a day. So when you get the dropper, you can just drop it under your tongue. Um, but I'm gonna try it on my skin as well. Um, similarly to what I use Blue Tansy for as well, if, if either in a mask or adding a drop to your serum or moisturizer at night. So super excited to try this because I mean, you know, if we can affect that enzyme that breaks down, you know, the collagen elasticity, then why would we not do it? So that is one oil that is not going to be available until December unless you get it as a pack. So again, very important to get the whole pack if you can this month. Um, okay. 
Um... Oh, the other thing I should mention as well in relation to the yarrow palm is that there is a mosquito flying around. Where is my peppermint? Um, is it has a higher antioxidant factor than vitamin C and vitamin E. So that's another really important point as well, I think. Oh, we've lost Facebook again. Let's just go back in. The pack is going to be available hopefully tomorrow. Uh, it says October 2nd US time. So fingers crossed uh, it will be available tomorrow and it will be 230 US dollars, uh, which is much cheaper than buying them all, you know, individually. Okay. Which is amazing. And you get them all straight away as well, because again, like I said, that one in, in particular isn't available until December. Okie dokie. Uh, I might hurry it along because otherwise we're going to hit the hour. Um, okay. One to two drops internally per day. I mentioned that. Um, so drop under the tongue. Another way that you can use it, which I'm going to plan to do is dermal rolling. I don't know if anyone has a dermal roller. I only use it once a week because I have incredibly sensitive skin. Um, even then, even if you don't have sensitive skin, I would not be dermal rolling three times. I would be doing it maximum twice. Um, but basically when you roll it on your skin, it pricks your skin ever so slightly. It's not painful. I mean, you can feel it, but it's not painful. Um, so what you could do is you could dermal roll your skin and then when you apply, and basically what it does is it stimulates collagen. That's the intention behind using a dermal roller. So you could dermal roll your skin and then perhaps use your serum with a drop of the Yarrow Palm and rub that in because it's going to absorb fantastically after you have used the dermal roller on your skin. Okay, so this is, it's one that you should have on your counter, on your bathroom counter, I think personally, because even if you're taking it internally, you know, easy, easy done, right? Okie dokie, turmeric, this smells like shit. It is disgusting. I don't know how else to explain it, but it, it smells horrendous. Um, yeah, it's, it smells horrendous. It kind of smells a bit like, um, I don't really know, to be honest, a bit like poo. I don't know. It just doesn't smell very good. Um, it's very yellow. Um, turmeric powder comes from the roots of the spice. I just, oh, it's not very nice. Um, but this is going to be the most powerful way to incorporate incorporate turmeric in your body. So there's probably a lot of people that have turmeric lattes. Um, again, I even find those hard to stomach. I'm not a huge fan of the powder. Um, yep, you could do, no, it does not smell like curry. It does not, in my opinion, but I don't really have that much curry, so I'm not quite sure. Um, but you can use it in your curry to cook curry. Um, so they, doTERRA have been working on the sourcing of turmeric for two years. Um, it comes from India and Nepal. Um, so the amount of turmerones is what it is called. Um, make this the gold standard of turmeric. That's how it's been explained. You are a weirdo, Tracy, because I cannot stand it. Um, I'll be interested to see what you think of this one then. Um, okay, and it also has cestoterpenes in it as well, uh, which are really antiseptic and anti-inflammatory. Um, and those turmerones that I was saying, like the gold standard of turmeric oil, that is what crosses the membranes um, and provides tissue support. So it's going to be incredibly supportive for your body, similarly to why you have, you know, turmeric lattes. Um, sustained cardiovascular support protects your liver. So having it internally, one to two drops, however you want to do it. I have not plan I have not done it yet because I'm like, I don't even know where to start. Um, I really do want to use it though because it's just going to be so incredible for our bodies. So I do want to try it. I'm just not really sure what to do yet. <laughs> um, it's more concentrated than the powder. So if you are using it, yes, every day they say to take one to two drops of turmeric. Um, so I would add it post cooking. So if you're using it in curries or eggs or whatever you're using it in, um, add it at the very end. So not during the cooking process. Um, that would be my recommendation. Um, great for your skin, antiseptic and antioxidant properties. Um, yep, veggie capsule, definitely. Um, also great for your skin elasticity as well. So there's, there's a theme here happening with a lot of these oils in terms of your skin health. Um, you could even do a turmeric mask. So use it on your face if you really wanted to as well, if you could handle the smell. Um, so, you know, with a bit of honey, fraction of coconut oil, that type of thing. 
Um, also really great for your muscles and stress. So if you're tense, applying it to your body, again, if you can handle the smell. Um, and if you're coming down with something as well, you can take it internally, use it in a steam cup. So three to four drops uh, in a hot cup of water, leaning over, taking a few deep breaths is another way that you could use it. Now, um, yeah, like I said, I haven't done it yet. I'm very interested to try it because, you know, turmeric is, I guess, I kind of used to think it was a fad, but it's definitely not. It is incredibly supportive for your body. I just have never been able to stomach it. So not sure how I'm going to use this yet. I really do want to take it internally. Um, so veggie capsule might be the easiest way for me to do it. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. Okay, so that is pretty much it. I thought I'd just do a brief rundown of how I plan to implement them. Um, oh, that's awesome, Hannah. Yeah, so turmeric is, is incredibly supportive for your muscles. Um, and a lot of people have, have it for that reason. So look, I do think it's really important to have um, drop in olive oil and add to vegetables. Ooh, I'm going to have to try that. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yes, let's do that, Tracy. I'm assuming that you're going to be buying the pack anyway, so <laughs> we'll be able to try it together. Okay, so just a little bit of a rundown of how I plan to implement them. Like I said, I only just got most of them today. So, oh, veggie soup. Yeah, send that through. I would love to try that. Um, what I plan to do. Okay, so I am going to be giving this a go. I'm going to be using this every day and I will report back on how good it is. Like I said, if you find that, and this goes goes for all of a lot of natural deodorants because a lot of baking soda can get gritty. Um, just pop a drop of essential oil on the top and you'll be good to go. Obviously gonna, gonna, going to be using that. Um, kids oils, haven't had a huge opportunity to be using these yet today um, or you know at all. So I'll be using these and keeping you posted. Um, they're definitely not as strong as the... Um, emotional aromatherapy touch rollers or like even you know the on guard touch um lavender touch nowhere near as strong so going to be great for kids um like i said the recommended age is three and up but i will be using them on clementine as she is too totally up to you uh so in the mornings um i will be putting pink pepper probably on my dry skin brush i also love to use aroma touch um which is great for relaxing your muscles um, and for circulation I also sometimes use Cypress, which is also great for circulation and Slim and Sassy or Smart and Sassy, whichever market you're in, um, that is the metabolic blend. So really great for cellulite, breaking down cellulite, um, circulation, blood sugar, all the good stuff. So I will be using that uh, on the dry skin brush and I'm going to try pink pepper for a while, see how that goes. Just two drops is all you need. Um, so I'm going to be doing that. And then I'm going to be using this. Like I said, if I'm going to be you know, out in the sun for the entire day over a long period of time, I am not going to use this. I'm just going to use fractionated coconut oil and a non-citrus oil. So whatever, do whatever you want. Um, I do that every morning anyway, but I'm, I'm loving this. This I am all over. Look how beautiful and glowy that is. Oh, it's just amazing. So I'm a huge fan of this. Um, this is going to not be available from this month. So if you want this now, get it in the pack. Um, I'm also going to be using green mandarin in my water every day. Um, so just one to two drops in my big swell bottle. Um, tastes amazing. Tastes really, really beautiful. Um, I'm also going to diffuse that at night, I think, with maybe some sandalwood or even some vetiver, some of those woodier scents. Um, yeah, that's my plan for tonight. So I'll let you know how that goes. Um, Yarrow Pom, I'm going to take two drops under my tongue uh, every day. And then every few days as well, I'm going to use it uh, on my skin with my serum. I use the My Skin Oil Cleanser um, and I also have a DIY one. So you can use jojoba oil or hemp seed oil if you have oily skin um, and then just add your oils in. So frankincense is great and lavender is great as well. Add yarrow palm, gonna give that a whirl. Turmeric, maybe I'll be making some olive oil and turmeric vegetables. Um, I am gonna find a way to take it internally. Not really sure what I'm going to do with this yet. I'm going to have a think and a bit of a research about this. Um, Kabiba, one to two capsules at night for a good night's sleep. And Magnolia for all of the calming support, especially, I, th I think this is just a, a female oil. Um, I'm interested to see what Tom thinks because it is, it's delicious. So I can't wait for him to smell it as well. Also going to add this into my skin routine. So like I said, in my bathroom, I've got rose, jasmine, 
Sally Bell, Lavender, Neroli. I'm going to be adding this beauty to the mix as well. Um, uh, mouthwash every morning, every night. I'm going to be doing that. Um, and that's it. I think that's it. Um, oh, actually, um, Tracy, if you're still on, I thought of a way that we can use turmeric in our coffee. So I have bulletproof coffee every morning, although Tracy probably is not happy with me having bulletproof because Carl is an incredible coffee brewer. Um, but I'm going to have my, yes, you're still on, my bulletproof coffee um, with a drop of turmeric and a drop of cinnamon because I'm feeling like the cinnamon might drown out the turmeric. Yeah, I didn't think that would fly. <laughs> um, but that's what I'm going to try because, like I said, turmeric is bleh. So I'm going to do a drop of cinnamon and a drop of turmeric. So I will keep you posted on how that goes. Um, in terms of how many drops you have internally, um, there is a safe usage chart. So if you Google doTERRA essential oils safe usage, you will find the chart and that says to use maximum of 24 drops of essential oil internally. I would use maybe 10 every day um, and that leaves some space you know if you're starting to feel under the weather and you want to take a veggie capsule um, you know with your immune bomb in there like your on guard lemon tea tree frankincense um, you know then you can so that's that's generally what I have internally um, but maximum 24 so that's it incredible products um, incredible promotions if you jumped in after the start of the live um, the promotions are at the, at the very beginning. So make sure you jump on and have a look. If you're on my team, I've already sent the email out. So have a look at that. If anything doesn't make sense, respond to the email and I will help you. Um, but this is a fun month. This is a really, really fun month. Um, yeah, I'm super excited. And just in relation to um, this deodorant as well, I think they are going to bring out a baking soda free version and also a citrus bliss version, which will smell insane. Um, but yeah, loving this so far. And I know for a lot of the people that have been using this since convention, um, they're obsessed with it. So yeah, that's it. If anyone has any questions, let me know, but I hope that was helpful. Um, yes, you can purchase all products as a kit over on Facebook. That question you can in your U S back office, hopefully from tomorrow at worst, it will be at worst. It will probably be Wednesday. Okay, so keep an eye on that. For everyone on my team, you'll see me, um, you know, contact you about it and send out an email when it becomes available. Um, so if you have your LRP set for the next couple of days, please push it back um, just, just so that you can decide. I'm um, sure you do, Tracy. Um, but I'm, yeah, I'm, I've been hanging out to do a US order, so I'm really glad that this has happened. Um, I've got two minutes to go, so that's it from me. I hope that was helpful. Um, super excited. Super excited and, and great to start stocking up on Christmas presents as well. So, um, you know, if there's a few things that you don't really want in the kit, then pass it on because everyone needs essential oils in their life because they're life changing. But that's it from me. Hope you all had a great long weekend for those that had one um, and I'll chat to you all soon. Bye.